there is uh, there is a blue planet on the far side of the universe. It is a very special for one reason. Only children live there. Live there. It is called the kids planet. The story begins on a very small island. Two kids are walking on sandy beach. On a sandy beach. They are very good friends. Their names are James and Elizabeth. Look, I see a very strange star. Where? That's no star. It's a space rocket. It's going to crash with on the island. The space rocket looked more like a vacuum cleaner than a space shop. Studily there appeared a strange looked the ground in the doorways. Hello kids, my name is Mr. Jolly. I can do anything. I am bring come true maker. I can make your red stars dreams come true. Let's see. What's a great fun you can think of? When the moon is full. When clip the cliffs. When I watch the sunrise. When the butterflies fly. Oh, I am so sorry kids, but this is so boring. I am falling asleep. Let's talk about real fun and games. Do you want to fly? Of course, we want to fly, like butterflies. Show me where the butterfly sleep and I will make you fly. Mr. Jolly sprinkled the butterfly dust over the children's hands. Wow! wow we're, we're flying! Fly, we're flying! Fly. This, this is the greatest fun ever! Forever. But soon the kids started to skate. They won't what sour for fear of causing the butterfly that off. The journey had a solution. They will never need to shower again. I will give you magic stuff made from the rainbow. It's exchanges for a tiny piece of your youth. The kids were so happy that before long, ever young become bored again. They wanted to fly all night too. They they ran to Mr. Riley to complain. How can you help us? I have a solution. For just a tiny bit of your youth, at 12 o'clock, I will deny the sun to the sky above your island. From that moment on, it will always be day. The children on the island Louis hide Mr. Jolly around. He made like selecting ever dying was adventure. Let's have a race, a competition to see who is the fastest. In the race, Elizabeth and James played dirty. They begin to fall and fall and fall. They landed in a dark, dark forest. I don't think the sun will rise. We are on the dark side of the planet in the endless night. Let's work together. I don't want to return home. I'm sorry. Me too. Let's hug and make up. They couldn't hug because of the my stuff. Look out, please. Don't eat us, Mr. Ah, I eating you? Hey, kid, don't go so quickly, my friend, and I will love to eat you. Mr. Spider loved the smell of the butterfly dust. She tried to catch 
James and Elizabeth in her web. Thanks to the magic stuff, they set off. Mr. Spider was so frightened, she ran away. Elizabeth and James become now as the butterfly monsters. The scary stories about James spread, so not to be eaten to the animals the world gives them gifts. I give you a lamp. Thanks. I give you a rabbit stick. Thanks. I give you potatoes. I give you milk. I give you a smile. I give you a warm. But the hyena sitting in the back was silent. He has something mysterious.